What's going on guys? Slinging Sticks. Adventures again. I wanted to go over something with you guys about using hot melt for your inserts for your arrows. A lot of people say that they have problems uh, with their inserts pulling out and the hot melt doesn't work real well. A lot of different things, right? Well, you can't just lay the glue on there like that and just stick it in. Right? Just kind of put it on there so so and stick it in what you got to do is you get it get it pretty hot get it to where it's it's pretty hot and it's running pretty good you want to get your insert pretty warm get everything kind of running and you'll see it start to move down your insert right once you get it to there you start spinning and pumping this arrow and what it does is it pushes all this glue into all those little grooves in there and you want to get it all the way around spin and push and what that does is it gets it in all those grooves, right? And and be pretty liberal about it, right? Put some glue on your inserts. I see a lot of places and shops, they just kind of put a little bit of glue on there and, and they just push it in. Well, that's not really going to hold. I want glue in a 360 degree contact from the insert to the arrow shaft. I want as much glue contact with the shaft as I can possibly get, so... Next time you guys are building arrows, try it out. Another thing that'll help you too, and you don't have to use this. This is a small game head from G5. I just like it because I can pinch it and I can control the insert a little bit better. But uh, yeah, next time you guys are trying to do your own stuff, try that out. Try and get the glue all the way around it. And spin and pump that insert into your shaft. And uh, that, should, that should give you some better results. 